Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So this is a quick setup video of Alien headphone stand. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily set up this stand with any Wi-Fi network in your home and uh, able to change the effects and the lightning. So once you connected it with the power supply, the first thing you have to do is to wait for 10 to 15 seconds because in that much time, it kept on searching the previously connected network. And if it didn't find it, it will open an access point for you and the name of that access point is alien and the default password is one two three four five six seven eight and once you fill out this password the only thing you have to do is to click on that Wi-Fi network and a setup page is going to be open up so after clicking on configure Wi-Fi this page is going to be open up and on this page you can easily see the list of Wi-Fi network available to you now you can click on any of the available network to you and from thereafter fill out the password and make sure not to change the static IP because this is going to open the web browser app for you so make sure to remember it so here one thing you need to keep in mind that the router with which you are going to make the connection make sure the ip address of that router starts from 192.168 point dash point dash so if the router ip address starts from 10.0.0 point point something then it will definitely going to connect but the web browser app is not going to be open up so make sure to remember this thing also so once you click on the save button you are good to go now the only thing you have to do is to open up the ip address which is the default ip 192.168.1.222 once you open this ip address in your browser then this user interface is going to be open up and there are a bunch of pre-made effects already been listed into this on to the left side you can see an rgb spectrum and from that spectrum you can choose any color you want based on the effects on to the right side in that list and uh, under that spectrum you will see three different buttons the first one is going to increase or decrease the brightness the second one is going to increase or decrease the speed of that particular effect and third one is used to play all the effects from top to bottom and it also works if you select any particular effect and then proceed further on all of the effects along with them random or rainbow has been written you can't change the color other than that rest of them you can choose any color according to your will for the demonstration of this video i'm going to choose the cyan color and i'm going to kept it onto auto cycle so that you are able to see all the different kinds of modes available in this stand along with all of these things you also need to maintain a good wi-fi connection otherwise it might be kept on restarting the stand repeatedly
so that's pretty much all about the setting process and i hope it will help the buyer to understand how to easily able to configure this stand over his wi-fi network till then goodbye have a great day